Jimmy, please say something. James? What? Who are you? Mom, I thought you told me never to talk to strangers. Like I said before, Jimmy, please be nice to your new stepfather. Okay, rich guy. I love it that you're twice as old as my grandfather and you're fat and bald. Uh. That's enough! I've had it with you, you little brat! Mind a bit, you Half a mind is right. Suddenly he realizes. I can't believe you, you little monster. We'll deal with you when we get back from our honeymoon. Next year. Got something for you, punk! Well, calm Ever hear of being courteous? Did you hear that Mr. Galloway had scotch on his Boy, oh, my no, intelligence is again. Hey, Jimmy. Let me show you around. That's Russell's locker. You know, the big ape who almost put you in the hospital. Enough talk! Now I smashed you! Come on, give me a break. Time to pay your Russell tax! I don't want any trouble. <laughs> Stupid. <laughs> Say Russell rules! Say it! Let's break into it and steal something. That'll teach him. Careful around the prefects. They don't have much of a sense of humor. Well done! You just made a serious mistake! Oh, so you 
want to scrap? You brought this upon yourself. I hate you. She leave me. Someone needs to be Thanks. Um, want to make out? Feeding time at the zoo. Okay, here's the deal. Over there, we got the nerds. Of course, they're complete social outcasts. They look pretty harmless. They're actually sneaky bastards. Their turf is the library. And those are the preps. They're all money and condescending attitudes. Yeah, massively inbred and completely brainless. Very observant, Jimmy boy. Now, over there are the greasers. They think they're tough. Or at least try to look tough. Wouldn't advise messing with them, at least not yet. They hang by the auto shop. And last but not least, the jocks. These guys rule the school. Definitely avoid them. Whatever, I'm not afraid of some dumb roid monkeys. You'll learn. Come on, let's go. You're here to learn, not to goof off. Get to class. What are you doing in here? Oh, right. Class. Take care to follow my instructions precisely, as we will be working with volatile chemicals today. Good job. Keep paying attention. I said I'd do it. Have you ever been in a fight? Might find a use for that. Need, like, snack break? And tea break in school. Why do I get so nervous around boys? Never doing aerobics again. Never! You want a piece of fatty? Hi. Fudge Blaster! I'm really sorry. Dingleberry!
Anger management is overrated when you can beat people. You seem to be making yourself quite comfortable here, my boy. I'm just trying to fit in. By fighting? By making a nuisance of yourself? That is not the Bullworth way, boy. Yeah, you could have fooled me. What? I said you could have fooled me. This place is full of bullies and maniacs. Nonsense. That's just school spirit. Hijinks. Why, in my day, we felt nothing of castrating the new boys. I want you to stop this nonsense, Hopkins. I want you to behave yourself. You might learn something. Fine. Can I go now, sir? On your way. Hey, I saw you sucking up to Crabble Snitch. What? Shut up! Screw you, new kid! This is what we do to teachers' pets around here. You better not... Ow! <laughs> come here, you little... Yeah, come and get me! You're a whip, new kid! Word up, Coolio! Ah, uh, you suck! I saw it. You ran to I need a plan. I'm out of here! My work here is done. Ah, hello, class. The curriculum demands that you do these vocabulary uh, assignments. Why don't you finish them here in class? That way you'll have more free time. That has to be some sort of slang, yes? I'm afraid that's not English. Good 
one. Try again, James. That's right! Well done. Keep it up. I don't think that's in the dictionary. I'm afraid that's not English. That has to be some sort of slang, yes? Try again, James. I don't think that's in the dictionary. I'm afraid that's not English. I need a drink. Come on, James, just apply yourself a little harder. Collect that. I've got your present right here. So that's a good idea, right? Yeah, okay, all right, sure, I'll do it. <clears throat> hey man, what's going on? Not much. I was just telling Petey here about my idea to take over the school. I mean, my plan for us to take over the school. What plan? Don't worry, Jimmy. It's just a little something I came up with. It's sink or swim, my friend. And if you're good at swimming, you gotta let the losers drown. Why don't you guys leave the thinking up to me? What? What? What, what the? Can't you say anything else? <laughs>
You know what, Petey? You were right. Jimmy is pretty dumb. What'd you say about me? Whoa, nothing. No, no, no. All I said was that you had to be pretty dumb to get expelled from so many schools, that's all. <laughs> Relax, James. All he said was that you must be dumb. Or maybe you're all messed up because you came from a broken home. What'd you say about me, dwarf? Come on, dude. Chill. No, 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 no. Gary's taking everything out of context, man. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Don't lie, Petey. Don't you lie. Because you know what happens to liars? No, no, I'm not lying. We kick them in the balls! <laughs> <laughs> Come on, Jimmy, let's go see how good you are with this new slingshot I heard you had. Don't worry, friend. Nothing escapes my notice. I hear everything. You and me, we can do things. I need more growth hormones. Hey, Hopkins, you psychotic gimp! This way!
She's reading too many romance books. Long-range skill. You can get him with your slingshot. That's for me. Being lazy gets you. It gets. Why are you stopping, you damn slackers? I didn't tell you to stop. What are you doing, you lazy guts? Get going. I didn't tell you to stop. Thank mm -hmm. you. 
All right. Why can't there be a school just for Jim? Hey, Hopkins, let's play keep ups. Yeah, show me. Like this. Nice work, Jimmy. This is a beauty. She's got the hots from me, I know it. I saw Edna put a cat into the stick.
They should be what? kept in chains in the basement. You wanna mess with these 24-inch yeah, pythons? Machiavelli. What's up, more pain?